Good morning, everybody. Happy Tuesday. I hope you all had an amazing long weekend. Um, the last video I did, for some reason, there was no voice and that was ridiculous. So I apologize. Um, I deleted it and here's what I had to say. Um, I am a registered counselor and I do hold sessions um, online and privately. One of the questions lately has been, what is CBT? So CBT is cognitive behavior therapy. And what that is really is being present, being present in your own mind and watching yourself and learning from your reactions, okay? So, <clears throat> excuse me, there are a lot of different methods to, um, huh, how am I gonna say this? Slow down your reactiveness, especially when something has triggered you. And I know that lots of people don't love me using the word triggered. So when something snaps in your mind and you become super reactive and you can't always figure out why, there is a cycle that happens, okay? So the cycle is something is done or said that um, brings you back to a trauma and a trauma response. And that person may have done something completely innocently. It might have been a voice tone. It can be something incredibly simple, but whatever it was, <clears throat> excuse me, it does bring you back into this fight or flight, freeze fawn response, okay? And so lots of the times when we're in that response, we snap, we act a little psycho, we act a little crazy. Um, <clears throat> our reaction is probably 10 times what it should be if we hadn't have been triggered by something, okay? So then what happens is the other person watches us reacting this way. They don't necessarily figure out how a couple days later or even later that day we end up feeling guilty, okay? So then we're apologizing, 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 and then we go through as the overreactive person, as the person who's been traumatized and is triggered, we go through um, a guilt and shame period. And so I can't believe I react this way. I don't know what's wrong with me. Uh, there's, you know, all of these things that we start saying to ourselves and none of them are true. So with cognitive behavior therapy, what I ask is, when something triggers you, when you feel that over responsiveness and overreaction coming, slow down just to ask yourself something. What happened there? What was the trigger? <clears throat> and what I've learned, even with myself actually, is that when I started asking myself like, wait a second, what just happened here? Um, where did this come from? Then I was able to pause. I, I was less reactive and in turn started realizing what it was that was triggering me so then I could communicate that with other people instead of the overreactivity, which also eliminated the I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry cycle. And it also eliminated um, the self-doubt and self um, shame and guilt cycle. So it does help you become a lot more healthy. All right, guys. Um, just wanted to share the quick tip with you. I cannot wait to see you in the shop. I love you all. Have a really awesome Tuesday. Bye for now.